All right, the big derby prep this weekend is the Louisiana Derby taking place at the fairgrounds on March 27th. It's a good field, it's a really deep field, 13 horses this is the biggest derby prep field-wise that there's been. It's also got a lot of talent. Um, I think it's probably got more talent than the Florida Derby, it seems top to bottom, and it's maybe not quite as good as the Rebel was a few weeks back, but it's a really solid field. You got 13 horses in here, so I'm gonna try to go through them quick. I'm gonna first talk about the horses I just don't think are real win contenders. I think Hotep's a little bit too slow. Mission Impassable, I think, has distance limitations. Out of the nice mare La Paz, that's a lot of speed influences there. The program, I think the sham was a sham, and that's a pun. Um, you go to Island Soul, a little bit slow. Wow, 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 looks like cheap speed to me. Mr. Mardi Gras just has not shown enough. And Backtrack, he's got a lot of upside but the horses won a maiden claimer and an entry level allowance race. He's, a, he's run six furlongs in both of his career starts. I don't think he's gonna get two turns and I'm not gonna trust a horse like that out of the 12 hole. So that's leaving, that's narrowing it down to just a few main contenders. Um, the two of the favorites are gonna be Discreetly Mine and Drosselmeyer. Discreetly Mine got a perfect trip last time out in the Risen Star. He's a really nice racehorse, but I still think he might have some distance limitations being out of pretty discreet. A half brother to discreet cat the unbelievably talented sprinter miler that didn't really go two turns. Drosselmeyer, really pretty good horse too, but out of the 13 hole, he had no excuse in the Risen Star, he was right on the rail, and he just came up short. I don't think you can play those two horses at short prices. That leaves four main contenders as I see him. You got Fly Down, A Little Warm, Ron the Greek, and Stay Put. Now Ron the Greek and Stay Put basically look the exact same to me. I like Stay Put a little more than Ron the Greek just because of the bigger morning line. They're both one-dimensional closers. They're both going to be running late. And they've got a shot. I mean, there's more speed in here than there was in the Risen Star. Both of those horses made moves in the Risen Star. They just couldn't catch um, Discreetly Mine, who had a dream trip. So if you wanted to play Ron the Greek or Stay Put, I would have no problem with that. I think they both look like they have shots here. The two that I'm really between, though, are Fly Down and A Little Warm. I think a little warm is probably the most talented horse in this field. He's, a, he's only sprinted so far, but his last race, he raced to Funny Bone, who looked great once again, winning this past weekend. A little warm faced him in the Hutchison, where he ran a really good second. He's a fast horse. He has a lot of talent. I think a little warm has a huge shot in here. That's the horse I'm ultimately going to pick just because I'm going with talent here. The other horse I really kind of like is Fly Down. Last time out, off the layoff, he was coming off a five-month layoff in an allowance race. He ends up beating first dude by a head. The move fly down made around the turn was really, really, really strong. He came right up to the field from way out of it. He ran a really good race there. He flattened out a little bit, but it was off a big layoff. I think he's got a big shot at impacting this race at a price. So I'm going to go with a little warm here. I think you're going to have to use fly down. Use the deep closers, stay put, and run the Greek. Don't completely discount Discreetly Mine and Drosselmeyer, but they're going to be underlays. And, you know, for a price coming up late, maybe you use Backtrack. I mean, he's a little cheap, but he's got some talent, and you never know what will happen. At 30 to 1 on the morning line, you, he could get a piece. So that's it. That's the Louisiana Derby. Really good race. Let's see what happens.